Hey YouTubers, this is Tequila and I'm here to do a nail tutorial on a very easy nail tutorial with some KISS products. I get a lot of questions from people asking me what products I use and where you get them and this and that and yes, most of the stuff that I do use when I'm doing other people's nails is things that you would need to buy from a um, beauty supplier online or you know, things like that. Y'all have seen my um, supply cabinets but what a lot of people don't understand um, or may not know is that a lot of the stuff to do your nails you can get actually at your local drugstore. Um, for instance, this kit is from Kiss and it's a complete acrylic um, kit. I've done a video in the past on easy nails, but it was with the dipping, the one where you dip your nail into it. This one actually comes with the brush and everything. $15.99 for this kit. Everything that I use today on these nails is um, a Kiss product, well, almost everything. It comes with all these nail tips here. It comes with a brush, which is a decent brush, considering. And you get um, clear acrylic. It comes with it. It comes with a little dipping jar. And it comes with this um, apple fresh scent, which you put in the acrylic to help with the smell. It comes with the liquid acrylic. And it's a good size bottle. And another thing is if you run out, they also sell them by themselves. Okay, and this one by itself was $3.99, which is a very good deal. It comes with the um, primer. It doesn't come with a dehydrator, but I do use a dehydrator. And it also comes with um, glue. And it comes with a nail file. And a buffer. So it's a really good kit for um, $15.99. Now I bought some extra white tips from KISS for $6.99 because I needed them to be a little bit longer than the nails they provided. So now we're going to get started on the nail. Um, I have a little bit of glitter going on here. This is just a basic glitter that you can get at the dollar store. Um, you can use arts and crafts glitter just as easy as anything else. So um, I actually just poured a little bit into this is how easy it is to make an acrylic mix, acrylic glitter. Pour a little bit into a lid, add a little bit of powder until you get to the, um, to a little bit of, I'm tongue twi twisted, until you get to the level of that you want. Some people like a little bit more acrylic in, in there and some don't. For me it didn't matter because I still went over it with a top coat, with a top clear acrylic. So there it is. Did you see that? You didn't see any of that, did you? Well, anyways, I mixed it up with this, and then it's ready to be used. So, I'm going to do that now. I'm also going to be using some Fimo, which I got this whole thing for 99 cents on eBay, and it was free shipping. Like, you really can't mess up with that. Like, it's easy stuff. So, what I'm going to do is I'm going to glue my nail tips on. Okay, so now I have the nail tips. And what I'm going to do before I cut them is I'm going to add my dehydrator, which you don't have to use, but I like to use it because I have oily beds. So I'm going to use OPI's dehydrator. And then I'm going to apply the primer. Okay, so now I'm going to cut the nails down to my desired length. So now I've got them down to the length that I want. I'm going to try to adjust the camera. So hopefully you can see from here. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to be adding this pink which is also a KISS product that you can get at your drugstore or your local beauty supply. It doesn't have to be Sally's. You can go to those um, Rinky Dink type beauty supplies and they'll have this as well. I'm going to add pink to my bed. Using the brush. And I'm going to add that to the bed. I'm just going to kind of let it flow for a minute. And then I'm going to start pulling it in to the smile line. Just like so. Very, very simple. You see how it stayed away from the skin? I just kind of let it do its own thing. If you get a, um, the right size pearl, it'll pretty much do itself, its work itself. So now I'm going to do the next one. Get a pearl. Place it right in the middle, press it a little bit, and just kind of let it flow. And then move it into the smiley line.
I'm add a little bit more liquid to my brush like I just did and it helps spread it out. If it dries too fast, add a little bit more liquid and you'll be okay. Now that I added the pink to the bed, I'm going to grab that simple mixture with the silver um, glitter that you can get in the arts and crafts section, whatever color you want to use. And I just added a little bit of powder to it, of the powder clear acrylic. And I'm going to grab some onto my brush, just like so. I'm going to apply it to the smile line, and then I'm going to move it up and fade it in. Just like so. Yeah. And then I'm going to come back over here and clean up the smile line. Grab me some of that acrylic glitter mix on the smile line, work it over and work it up. Work it over and work it up and make it just a fade into the nail. Go back in and clean up that smile line and then work it up. Very simple. Very, very, very simple. So next I'm going to grab some clear acrylic because you want to seal that in so whenever you're filing away the access um, you won't ruin the glitter so I got a pearl I'm gonna apply it right to the middle that way it connects the tip with the pink and then work it up make it go all over the nail work it up Do it again with the thumb it's very easy and very fun, and you can buy this kit at Walgreens, um, whatever drugstore is near you. For the first time, I really saw it. Gentle, I, I'm not. That's my brother. The gentleman is my brother, Mormon. She won't let that stand. Okay, and I'm going to clean off my brush real quick while this dries, and then we'll file and buff. So now I'm going to file and buff the nail. So now that I've have it, I have it filed and buffed, and you can see there's a little bit of glitter in there, I'm going to be adding some Citrus Fimo to it. I showed you this earlier in the video. You can use any Fimo. You can also use flowers, feathers, anything you want to put in your nail. I'm not going to use the flowers today, I'm going to use Fimo. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to apply a little glue on top of this little gidget gadget here. Use a pair of tweezers. And I'm going to grab an orange slice. I think I'm going to do it to my middle finger. So it's not to be on every nail. So there's that one and then I'm going to add a orange more of a redder color fruit to it um, you want some water? Sure. And I'm going to apply it right next to it kind of touching it just like so the female will the female huh the female will tend to curl up so that's why I just press it and then it hardens it looks just like this now I have an orange over here already I'm going to put that here and I think I'm going to add another one to my thumb. Just kind of do every other nail. This time I'm going to apply the glue straight to my nail. See if it works out better. I'm just pressing crazy. until they harden. Okay, and then I'm going to do the same to the other hand as well. Okay, so now I have added the fruit to it, and um, I was going to pierce these. I was going to pierce these and add um, 
a ring to them, but I'm not going to do it. I'll probably do it on the next video so you can see how to use these. It's really cool when you have a little dangle hanging from your nail. I just don't really have time to do it right now. So now I'm going to add the clear coat, and I'm using Sally Hansen's Powerful Acrylic Gel, which if you've seen my other videos, you know this is my favorite um, gel to use. It's just like the um, UV gel without the lamp, but you can also use any clear coat that you want to. Okay, and this is the final look on the nail. I'm going to add some um, cuticle oil around the edges, and then that's it. But this is an easy way for you to get your nails done, and for 15 bucks and less, or less, depending on your drugstore, using Kiss products. They're very good products, and I highly recommend them. Um, look at your local uh, drugstore or your beauty supply. I actually noticed that this kit was $15.99 in the drugstore, but at the beauty supply it was $8.99. And I'm not talking about Sally's. I'm just talking about one of those regular beauty supplies that are all over the town that sell the wigs and, and all that stuff. Those places have these kits as well. All right, guys, stay tuned for the end for pictures. And if you have any questions, don't hesitate to leave them in the down bar. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you at the next one. And as always, blessed be.